and about how to create SAP BTP trial account. So in order to create this SAP BTP trial account, the first point is we need to have an uh, SAP uh, account, okay, user account. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to use my Gmail ID to create this uh, SAP uh, account and then from there we will create the trial account, okay. So currently I am in the page of creating SAP universal ID. I will provide this link in our uh, description, video description. Um, so I am providing my ID here, okay. So my, this is my Gmail ID. Uh, here I am trying to register for the SAP universal ID and clicking on next button. So re order request, in, okay, registration and provide the first name and last name. I am giving India as a location. And then I'm providing some password here. Okay, I am providing the acknowledgement and then the capture. Submit. So now what will happen? Uh, you know, one email, I will receive an email with a code. Let me check my email. Okay, I didn't receive that email yet. Okay, I received the OTP here, like, so I'm providing the number which I received and then provide the capture here. So now it's loading. So continue to login. So here you can see a SAP P user ID got created, okay, with my email ID. Next. So what's next? So now, uh, now we have an SAP account available now. Now we are going to create the trial version of the SAP BTP. So for that we need to go, uh, you know, access the decode account dot on demand dot com. So let me log into this URL. So it, here it is asking the user ID. So for with which user ID I just got registered in SAP, I'm using um, just a second. Continue. Here it is asking me to register um, our phone, uh, the phone number. So I'm going to register my phone number here. And then I have read the terms and conditions. Now I will receive an OTP to my phone number. Continue. <coughs> now SAP BTP cockpit is loading. So here it is asking the region. Before you continue, we need to finalize your trial account creation, which region you want to. So based upon the nearest region or to your you know um, place where you are living, you can take that region. Currently, I am taking my Azure. So here, the one more thing is this uh, US region is works with AWS and the Singapore region is with Azure. Okay, I'm taking the currently US with the AWS. So system is now, uh, you know, is, uh, SAP is creating my trial account. So the region it got assigned is US East, AWS region and the global account, all these got created now.
it will take a little bit time for the creation you see now the global account with so it has created one global account for me um, in the btp with this name okay in the global account it is trying to create one sub account so we will see all these details in detail uh, in the uh, upcoming sessions the name it given for the sub sub account is trial <coughs> global account is the main account that was created to uh, you know on our id and uh, under the global account we have a sub account so we can have multiple sub, sub accounts created under one global account but as part of this uh, trial uh, i think it is not possible to create multiple sub accounts uh, um, but in trial accounts we have uh, many limitations so whichever limitations you know uh, currently we have with those whatever we can learn we will try to learn as much as possible done so it has created uh, all this information for you now click on continue so now what we are going to do we are going to have a bookmark let's take this uh, url uh, as a bookmark on your system i am creating one sap btp folder in that so this is nothing but sap btp cockpit okay we call it as a cockpit here you can see you have a quick links to access btp application and cloud foundry you know different uh, tools from here and these are all the learning journeys that sap is providing tutorials step by step so which will be very helpful to learn the concepts here okay now i am currently in the btp cockpit from here now i can navigate into the trial account so to see my um, uh, global account information trial account information i need to go to the trial account so it is saying from this i you, you know uh, option create we can create multiple sub accounts here um, or else we can create a sub account under existing sub account also we can create you know it is like a, you know uh, differentiating between multiple things uh, so in the btp cockpit you see on the left hand side we have the menu bar like account explorer resources booster system landscape entitlement entitlements security so in the security you see the user users which are you know which can who can access this btp account currently i am only one who can access this btp account and this is my user id okay so if you if you want to share this btp account with the other users um, you know by you, the, you can provide you know the create the multiple users here now going to the account explorer here in the account explorer under sub sub accounts for example if you go to directories and sub accounts so here you have an option to create directories okay so directories are nothing but folders uh, what will happen is you can create sub accounts with respect to regions also um, we can uh, talk in detail about this one in uh, upcoming sessions now this particular video is mainly about how to create a btp trial account uh, you know uh, on our own so that we can learn things from using this account okay so this is how we create sub account so btp account and then in the btp now we can see the trial here so if i click on this uh, trial then it will uh, go into this uh, trial sub account okay in the trial sub account you can see there are a uh, general cloud foundry um, schema environment entitlements here if we see this is a sub account particularly the sub this is the subdomain tenant id sub account id all these information are important in later stages uh, at, at some places while binding to some services and all we use this information okay and this particular sub account currently is uh, from the us region created under us region okay and the environment is multi environment and the provider is the amazon web services so uh, we have amazon and we have azure we have google also currently here we have option for m we opted for this uh, amazon web services and azure service also we seen but we take for singapore region okay under the cloud foundry if you see this is the cloud foundry environment um, here we have the arcade and everything but as of now there are no instances created here okay we can create instances uh, in later point uh, you know uh, i will show you how to do this one also 
and this come environment and these are the entitlements so what are entitlements is nothing but this is the quota so because this is a trial version we are limited to do some services only okay if you want to have more services we can take a more and the quota represents the how much memory you know consumption and everything it will be for example here you can see sap btp environment uh, SAP build code so we can you know, we can create some SAP build apps using our trial account we can create some build automations and then uh, business application we can create some applications in the BTP um, application studio also these are all comes under uh, you see trial account this is standard account okay this is free 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 you can create build apps using our trial account free but in order to when uh, here information business that's uh, you know some something which are which are not available under free account we need to buy it separately but few things we can uh, you know use this uh, trial account itself to create things okay so about this one trial accounts so the next thing is so uh, as of now this is how to create a trial account in btp now let's talk about a few points about the global account okay uh, our btp architecture i can say in simple hmm? so a global account is use it to manage directories, sub accounts, members, entitlements, and quotas, okay? So now if we look into our global account, okay? In this global account, this is, a, you know, the main one, trial home is nothing but our global account, okay? In this global account, currently we are having the one sub account called trial account, okay? Um, let me click here. this is a one sub account okay so like this we can have multiple sub accounts but what happen is this a sub account also we can uh, incorporate in one of the directory okay if we see the architecture here this is global account under global account we can create multiple sub accounts and we can group these sub accounts also in part as far as, as a directory okay directory a contains one sub account and the directory b contains you know multiple sub accounts and each sub account is corresponds to one region that is important okay it means our global account when we creating our global account we created under us okay va so after in that global account we created a sub account when the sub account also by default more pointed to this region but we can create another sub account which is pointing to some different region you see again when i am creating the sub account it is asking me whether you want it in the us east or singapore okay so it means the parent id is still become our global account okay so that is one part so we can create uh, multiple sub accounts and each sub account is linked to one region okay now going to the next point so what is region so one if we take one sub account and this has, that particular sub account corresponds to one region like we can uh, as i said like we can get multiple sub accounts right why we create multiple sub accounts means based upon our needs you know we create multiple sub accounts and each sub account belongs to multiple regions so this particular picture saying that for example if you have you know, one sub account belongs to eu region one is, uh, belongs to us region like that okay and within this sub account we have multiple components like application areas services data environment and infrastructure so infrastructure is nothing but our azure okay for example uh, when we creating our sub account we taken the infrastructure as aws right we take in the in infrastructure as a aws uh, uh, one so we uh, likely we can have you know azure also and uh, cloud uh, google uh, google also is there okay uh, next point is on top of infrastructure we have environments okay so on top of environments we have services data and applications so when coming to the environments what sap is saying about environment environments constitute the actual platform as a service offering of sap btp that allows for the development and administration of business applications okay each environment comes equipped with the tools technologies and runtimes that you need to your business application so now if we see this picture here we have multiple environment one is cloud native and another one is cloud enabled under cloud native we have cloud foundry and uh, schema and uh, cloud enabled nothing but app environment 
okay so where exactly we can see information about this environment so here you see ours is multi environment and if i go to my sub account here and uh, this particular one we created under um, where is this cloud foundry okay it was created with the cloud foundry environment so if i go to here my instance and subscriptions also here if you see environments here it is the environment which is my current environment is a cloud foundry runtime okay and we can have create other one is a uh, schema and then uh, other environments also we can uh, integrate later point okay so the next thing is uh, what is the next point so we know what is infrastructure we know what is environment and the services and the data and then application so when coming to the services <coughs> service instances created in so here under the service we create service instances and under the service instance uh, the service instance can be either in cloud foundry or uh, schema or uh, kubernetes or other environments okay here in this place we provide we can see in coming time we can create some service instances uh, for our hana native cloud also okay on top of the services and now what will happen is whatever service you create here those are linked to the database okay for example if an application is running it needs uh, some database to store the data right so those uh, service instances will be created under this one okay we will look into this topic in detail in coming time and on top of this uh, service instances the next one is uh, applications so applications is nothing but the final one which uh, you know business application studio is one of the application uh, under this piece of application studio we can create different applica you know uh, multiple applications using different environments like uh, sap native hana and then you know uh, we have this uh, uh, pure uh, native java applications many kind of application can be created and all the applications information can be seen under this section you know uh, subscriptions so i hope it is clear so so far what we understand is uh, what is uh, the ptp architecture where we can uh, uh, you know one global account can contain multiple directories and this directory is optional if you want you can create directory or else simply you can directly create your sub account multiple sub accounts under the global account okay directory is just uh, you know uh, for uh, um, differentiating between you know um, to create some hierarchy kind of thing okay and uh, if we take one sub account under the sub account we can see all these kind of things application services data and environment infrastructure and we know what are all these okay uh, so a region is chosen at sub account level the selection of region depends on many factors so when we are selecting this region uh, you know for our sub account it depends upon multiple factors like the response time and latency so uh, if a company if an organization which is a multi uh, you know national means within different uh, uh, countries so based upon the people who are using you know but that particular uh, application uh, we will see the most you know uh, nearby region Okay, so the mining also we already discussed and we will see in detail about all this in the coming.